She's powered by twin 5.7 MPIs, Merc Cruisers. And a master stateroom has a king size bed with an eight inch memory foam mattress, beveled mirrored headboards, decorative lighting, designer ceiling fan, custom padded designer window treatments. This, we're in the galley area currently, uh, viewing the very comfortable uh, large sink. Uh, we're lo also looking at a trash compactor. We're looking at a uh, dishwasher. We're looking at full-size range, microwave, an abundance of storage, and beautifully built cabinets, all solid wood. Looking at a microwave. More inner, more storage. We're looking at uh, the electrical panel for the for the ships, all the ship systems. Double door with freezer, refrigerator. You don't see this in too many houseboats. Of course, you don't see too many 75 foot houseboats with an 18 foot beam either. The flooring in the galley area is imitation tile for durability. <clears throat> we don't see on most boats is, if you're ready for this. I'm ready for it. A dumb waiter. Boy, that worked for and me because I'm dumb. They got dummy showing it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to operate it, but we'll do that during the uh, sea trial survey and haul out. The tree, nice wine glasses. Very well appointed uh, countertops. The back side of this bar is, is a, an extension of the kitchen. So you have all this storage area once again. The dishes. What's down there, Carl? Okay, this is an office slash additional bedroom, which is very spacious. This is where you put your guests that you don't want to stay very long. <laughs> Fish and visitors stink after three days. Living room area. This this uh, almost takes up the full 18 feet of the boat with a ceiling fan, chandelier. Into the cabinet, surround sound. Real. That's not a decal, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, it's real. Stained, well, I mean, uh, yeah, stained glass. Stained glass. Nice. Very helm. comfortable and attractive helm station. Mm hmm. Uh, this, she's got the Smartcraft system uh, for onboard monitoring of all your systems. She has uh, also the bow uh, thruster and windlass controls here located. Stern drives up and down, keys. You have your uh, Fume detecting monitoring system. Once again, keep in mind we are hauled out of water, so we have a lot of fenders lying around and additional lines. Very attractive. Here, just don't sit on it when they drop it. Just don't sit on it. Pretty, pretty. Oh, yeah. Hydraulically assisted hatch for accessibility to the top deck. Whoa. Up here we have 26 feet of seating area. One, two, three, four ceiling fans. Fiberglass top. Once again, note the stanchions for supporting the top tied into the handrail. This is a custom built 360 degree bar with a gent air sink. Built in refrigerator. This would be where your dumbwaiter comes up. Okay, and here is the accessibility to the dumbwaiter, which is we showed previously, which is downstairs. All new Isenglass being installed on the boat. 
uh, complete with jacuzzi. Telephone system to the helm. This is your port side engine. This is uh, also the Mercury, matches the other engine. And this is the 300 horse power 5.7 Bravo 2 drives uh, on this engine. Maintenance and service, the boat is currently owned by a gentleman in ill health and he owns uh, or did own a marina with a full service department. So all the service work's been done on this girl. Thank you for uh, coming along with us on the viewing today on this 75 foot 2008 model Stardust houseboat. One of my last trips to the Bahamas. There is a boat very similar to it chartering down in the Bahamas. This will make a great charter boat for anywhere in the Florida Keys or down in the Bahamas or just about anywhere. Uh, price on this boat is $349,000 and she's worth every penny of it. Thank you. Call Sorry Dog Marine, 904-571-1350 for reviewing.